Hello, everybody. We are... <laughs> hey there. Yeah, there's, um... Uh, this was not the game that ripped off the Steve Vai song. That was, um... That was ECW... I mean, uh, WCW Revenge. This actually has a bit of a plot to it, so... Uh, we're gonna check this out. Hope it doesn't crash at the end, because, um... Yeah, it did on Sasha's uh, emulator, but... The Rock's uh, disturbing polygonal eyebrow. <laughs> right, I forgot I already replaced uh, some characters, but you'll see in a second. Sick it. Now this ain't no mercy. This is not no mercy. The tortured soul. Yep, there's Calypso and Austin Powers, yes. I've replaced a couple of people. Manami Toyota, yeah. Those were not two gang girls, by the way. That was, um... Watashi wa Calypso! I don't remember how you say the rest, but... <laughs> God. Man, these are the days where you can just change the game roster and the intro will just go with it. Like, God, I wish we could still do this. <laughs> Calypso punching... I mean, uh, China punching Scott Steiner in the balls makes the game go, Great! I forgot 2000 was, like, the game where Stone Cold was the protagonist, because, uh, No Mercy had, uh, The Rock. And there we have it. Actually did not crash. Thank God for that. So, oh, let me check something. Ah, okay, I guess it, uh... Yeah, we got the uh, Pantera ripoff uh, <laughs> music in there. So, something Rogdos actually told me, because I was doing a little test run in Road to WrestleMania mode, and I'm like, what gives? This is on normal. I'm getting destroyed here. According to Rogdos himself, this is the hardest Aki game. Like, the AI is just ridiculous. So, yeah, we're going on easy. Because I guess WrestleMania 2, like, here's the weird thing. Virtual Pro Wrestling 2's difficulty is not nearly as bad as WrestleMania 2000's, even though it's running on largely the same engine. So, I don't know what happened there, but we're just going to roll with it. Uh, how do we... Yeah, let's get... Oh, we should probably look at the, uh... Well, I guess we could look at the new roster in a second. So, Triple H is now just this model. Um, I think this is one of the Godfather Ho models, and I, I just didn't know what to replace him with. I ran out of ideas, so... <laughs> Here's our new OC, the Hot Topic Cashier. We got Calypso, of course, uh, replacing The Undertaker. The other Calypso. And uh, even more Calypso. <laughs> 
to a some <laughs> metal black Calypso and uh, head-on Calypso. This, this one didn't work quite as well, but whatever. We'll just go with it. Uh, I did not replace McMahon because I just couldn't think of anything in time, so, yeah. Eli Silverman from Cheap Show. Because, <laughs> you know, of course. Um, Richard Richard from Bottom, because I've just been watching a whole lot of Bottom. That's uh, quite a sentence I said. So this was pulled from, like, a WrestleMania 2000, like, uh, Game Facts call document. And I'm like, yeah, we'll phrase Bradshaw, Bradshaw with that. Uh, nothing really to... Here's where things get, in, like, interesting with a hack, though. Uh, these outfits are different from Freem Edition. Uh, there is not an Oz outfit. I could probably... I could have probably changed that, but... We got, uh, the... Ah, what do they used to call him? Well, let's call him Scott Hall. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> we got Scott Steiner! Actually, replace the second outfit with this, just so there's a chance he'll show up during Royal Rumble mode. <laughs> Will we have a Royal Rumble mode? Have you watched this channel? <laughs> we got the Hitman. Almost the same outfits as a uh, Freem Edition, but we got our uh, buddy Aki Man, who um... <laughs> uh, it turns out he actually replaces the dummy character. Because if you go in training mode and all that, that's that's uh, they're like roughly the same shape, so I... <laughs> so this is a very interesting case. Um, her models ripped straight from Virtual Pro Wrestling 1. And yeah, I, I love that it hasn't been updated to fit like the uh, the newer models at all. Like, I feel like it needs to kind of... Uh, it feels like it kind of needs to remain this way. And we got our new Japan fellas. But what's this? <laughs> I mean, of course, you know I needed to do that, right? Uh, did not make the uh, fake WCW revenge characters for this, for these folk, but they don't need them right now. Hiroshi Hase, he was actually not in a uh, Freem Edition, he was one of the replaced guys, but. So, Akiyama, uh, I actually made his, like, present day look here. Oh, one second. Okay, uh, the women are all pretty much the same as they were before, uh, including the bad stats. We got the MMA guys. There's only like four of them, but uh, this is uh, the Tiger Mask that you uh, saw in uh, Virtual Pro Wrestling 2, I believe. Boss Rutten, the uh, guy who's been getting a strange amount of YTPs as of the last couple years. We got uh, the guy who does the airplane taunt, yeah. <laughs> uh, famed Always Sunny cameo maker, Don Fry. Uh, right, uh, Shawn Michaels was in FMW for like five minutes. That's so weird. <laughs> yeah, d uh, in the episode where they meet uh, the maniac, the guy the maniac is fighting is Don Fry. It's like a blink if you and you miss it cameo, but <laughs> we got Cactus Jack and Mankind. Anita. Don Gun. And instead of Hayabusa, we have H. 
This was a real gimmick he did. Um, and uh, I assume it was because the uh, masks were kind of hard to really implement into the sack. At the same time, though, I, I do... I do appreciate that we get to see, like, a character we've seen in Aki games before, but looking completely different. And, uh... Here's all our, our creative characters. This was a request that Sasha made. Um... So, that is our accurate height. And I gave her better moves. <laughs> uh, oh, and better stats as well. Um, the funny thing is, we today, uh, watched an early 1992 All Japan Women match, where Tori was in there as Terry Powers, or Terry Power, or something, and you would not be able to guess it was the same lady. So, um, with that in mind... Alright, let's see where, uh... See where we go from here. I did one tag team match and it was like God. <laughs> that, that, that's, <laughs> that's not fair. <laughs> Dude, but it's like it's be solid at the start. Alright. Whatever though, we'll go with it. <laughs> Uh, there are some new themes. The Titan Fronds are the same, but... <laughs> I changed, like, all of her taunts. They were just generic, like, diva taunts before. Also, sorry for any, uh, soaring speech just now. Um, I'm currently eating a peanut butter jelly sandwich because I woke up like 10 minutes ago and I rushed to get, get something to eat before I started. <laughs> yep, there she is. Uh, she was known as uh, Black Widow. If you got WCW vs. The World. Uh, the only lady character in it, I believe. And really the entire virtual pro wrestling series. Which is weird. But, you know. Right, right. Just like Virtual Pro Wrestling 2's uh, version of them. I assume, uh, the fact that some of the names are shorter than the others is just due to, like, hacking reasons, basically. So I know some of the characters that replace were, like, Meat and Midian and Viscera and Draws, and they all have very short names, so... Alright, now we got, uh, we got the big boy. I really hope this does not set off any, uh, TMCA flags. But, you know. It's a... It's a bit crushed version of it, so... Should be good. Hey, frame. Yeah, that's, uh... Yeah, at least it's easy to just change it for yourself. But... Anyway. So, all of... All of Tori's strikes have basically been changed. <laughs> uh, her grapples mostly had because otherwise they were just like elbow strike, elbow strike. <laughs> like the the standard women slap is just terrible. It's so slow. My, my countering skills in this game are still very bad. 
<laughs> hey, like Ragdoll said, uh, you know, due to this game's difficulty, imagine putting it on easy would be like normal in Virtual Pro Wrestling 2 terms. Ah! Alright, let's, uh... <laughs> now, what was the kick I really liked? Yeah, that. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Misawa! <laughs> uh, it's always fun. I imagine the difficulty will kind of ramp up after a while, but yeah, like normal in this game is a nightmare. I don't know what is happening. Like, it was not nearly as hard in Virtual Pro Wrestling 2, and it it feels great knowing that that wasn't just me imagining that. I'm gonna hit you with the, uh... I don't know what her actual special is. Ah! Uh-oh. Come on. Oh, God damn it. You wouldn't let me do it. Oh, well. Spinning crescent kick is a really weird button. What's up? Ah! So is this. <laughs> What's, uh... What I still gotta get used to is there's no running grapples in this. Oh. Alright, bigger Tori. I really should have changed their name into Terry Powers, but there's no way you can really make the outfit uh, actually look like how it's supposed to. I don't know why I just didn't do anything there. I did also notice that uh, limb damage, or at least the indicators for it, happened way faster. Don't really know what that's about. I know what I gave her. <laughs> Be a Karamita kicker. <laughs> wow, Misawa didn't even try. <laughs> he was just like, yeah, no, I ain't, I ain't going near that. Almost 40 minute match. Oh, uh, X Pog versus Richard from bottom. Shit. I feel like the chat, like, chat box kind of messed up somehow. I don't know. Calypso and Mankind and Kevin Nash. Well, of course, Calypso won.
Yeah. <laughs> There's a reason why I'm just skipping all of them. <laughs> Another tag match? Okay. <laughs> Now, Monday Night Heat is where the uh, fabled Steve Odekirk cameo happened. I still have that whole episode on my uh, hard drive. <laughs> so we gotta see the D'Lo Brown entrance. I mean, we just gotta. It's weird as that you can simulate in Fire Pro a similar way, but it actually, I actually have confirmed that it does take like, it basically just does a super fast match in the background. Because, <laughs> um... Because, like, I did Fire Pro with a character that, like, the only character where it's, like, basically impossible to make a match progress. <laughs> and I put two of them together. Um. And the game just kind of, like, stopped trying to figure out who won. I think like, all their moves were just, like, position changes or something. And, uh. <laughs> The game just had no idea what to make of it, so I guess it actually does, uh, does some work. Okay. Speaking of D-Lo, I forgot there's, like, an official version of D-Lo for Fire Pro, so... I don't know if he was one of the uh, Dreamcast DLCs or whatever, of which there is a lot. Where you can even get those nowadays, I have no idea. <laughs> Once again, I did nothing. Sometimes the uh, tag in command just doesn't, you know, really want to do anything. Is that, like, the outfit Mark Henry actually wears normally in this time period? Because I thought he had, like, the, uh... I must be thinking of No Mercy. A scorpion <laughs> kick all of you. Yeah. But yeah, like uh the match that I ran in a previous test run was like Road Dog and X Pac and it was just like Impossible. <laughs> like, I don't know what it was. So like, I would beat Road Dog within an inch of his life, and he would just counter everything, and then go into special mode about three times. It was uh... a. <laughs> nope, that's not what I meant. That's also not what I meant.
Come on. <laughs> I have accidentally kicked my own partner more than once. They understand, though. Alright, time to see what our actual special is. I can get up. Oh, it's that! <laughs> Got right back up from it, though. Ah, damn it! Okay. <laughs> right. Whoa! Yeah, she's got the butt bump. Forgot about that. You know, the funny thing is, um, in the PS1 All Japan uh, women's wrestling game that I actually used from Melv Stomp, uh, ow! Uh, Manami Toyota um, was a playable character by default. In fact, everybody kind of was, except for Akira Hokuto, and there was like no saves or cheats I could you know, <laughs> get in time to unlock her, but you know. I don't know if Akira Hokuto's broken in that game or not, but, you know... And, uh... Perhaps unsurprisingly, the winner of that was a fairly obscure Joshi that I've never heard of before. I'm trying so hard to tag her in, and it's just not working. I'm using a controller I got like a day ago, because the buttons on the other one were kind of sticking. Thank you, god. You see, these are good basics. <laughs> good range, they're fast. Some of them make you bleed. I didn't really touch any of the back gravels, so they probably suck still, but... <laughs> ah. And even... Yeah, alright. No, oh, sorry. <laughs> Oh god damn it. Ugh. Tell you to help. Okay. I mean D Lo, you had to hire a uh, special, but you know, it's fine. Whatever. Not that it matters now. <laughs> ah. We're in trouble. I don't know how Misawa was like the <laughs> the warm up match, but you know. Maybe Hiroshi Hase, uh, just bogs him down that much, I don't know. I shouldn't have one of those moves. Dang. <laughs> Ugh. What gives? This team's getting good all of a sudden. Who's even legal now? <laughs> Is it you? I 
I do miss the names on the life bars. That's one good thing. Uh, that's one No Mercy exclusive I really appreciate. Time to switch to Toyota. <laughs> oh god, oh god, oh god. Thank you. <laughs> See, now he's just like invincible. Sorry! <laughs> Whoops. Oh, God. I was trying to make her do the, uh... Wow. Alright. Yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> now I can wrestle in peace. God. God, no, the, none of the counters are landing at all. Damn it. Okay, I just need to tag out at this point. Just made it. I think I might just be getting old, I don't know. <laughs> there are these moments where I'm just like, suddenly realizing something is happening and I should be reacting to it. And the hitboxes in these games sometimes. Oh my god. Yeah, this is basically what the Road Dog and uh, X Pac match were like. This is ridiculous. Yeah. It just feels like at some point, like, these guys just started countering every single move and gaining tons of spirit from it. Okay, we're on even ground here, though. His neck was hurt? <laughs> oh, wait. No, 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 no! Oh, God, please don't let him do a special. Please don't let... Tori, are you gonna, like, do anything about this? get him. Oh. <laughs> it was working the other times. <laughs> Boop. 
did a uh, giant swing? I think that was D'Lo. Or no, it was Mark Henry. Thank you. I know this is going to rope break, but every bit counts. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Wait, this is Toyota, so... Oh, whoops. That lasts so much less than, uh, No Mercy, which is great. <laughs> I remember that crumple state would last for like 10 seconds. Come on. Now I got attitude, you fucker. Wait, I'm not, I'm not the one with the palm straight goes. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Just get hit by it. How are you getting right back up from that? <laughs> Fuck you. One. Maybe the giant swing doesn't just do that much damage, I don't know. I was doing the so Dilo, you stay the hell away from me. Okay. Jesus. Even on easy, that was a bit of a headache there. <laughs> like, can I stop doing tag matches? <laughs> or is that just exclusively what you do in WrestleMania 2000? I don't have much uh, experience with it. Boss Rootin versus the Godfather. D <laughs> okay. Okay, I hope so. <laughs> Calypso and Calypso. And they just draw it. Okay. I'm just hoping I get to do a singles match tonight. That would be nice. <laughs> Yes, we're fighting Al Snow, I guess. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Man, Austin Powers getting to really make uh, Farouk work, huh? Oh, Mark Henry and D'Lo Brown are kind of fighting over that. What, ha what just happened. Okay. So there was that WWF Coke book that had Al Snow Peas, and basically they were Snow Peas that had, like, they were, like, cooked in sesame oil and stuff, and, uh, sounds really good. Okay. <laughs> well. Here, I'm Al Snow. <laughs> My counter timing just seems to be a mess. I don't know what's going on.
She just had that. I don't know. Come on. Actually. Okay. Actually, let's turn the referee on. Why not? Seems like the counter timing is way stricter in this game, too. <laughs> GB Earl Hebner, gotta love it. Yeah, she, she just has nothing for back grapples. Well, she has that. Does she have anything cool for this? Oh. Well, eh. I feel like this might be a squash match, I gotta be honest with you. There was a way to get like a Virtual Pro Wrestling 2 special or something? Hey! <coughs> oh god, this is not, not the time for my allergies to be acting up. Also, it doesn't seem like special lasts very long either. See, knowing this game, I'm 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 just fearing that he's going to enter God mode for a bit. <laughs> what should a chiropractor look at? <laughs> what should a chiropractor look look at? What? Am I having like a stroke or something tonight? I don't know what's going on. This is supposed to be a stream of Summit, not like a stream of me like deteriorating live on uh, stream here. Well, that can't be good for your health. <laughs> yeah, that was, yeah. <laughs> Help me indeed. <laughs> Big boss man versus Satoru Sayama. Ch Your international <laughs> champion, Mr. Ass. Aki man and Akiyama. That's the. <laughs> Alright. Probably do a couple more matches in this mode, then just go straight to the Royal Rumble. That's where them girl meat and potatoes is. Hey, Bean Cat! Yeah, the menu music, well, this menu music in particular, is just the pastiche of a Pantera song. I forget what it's called, but it is definitely just ripped from that song. <laughs> awesome Powers once again loses, baby. Oh man. <laughs> I don't want to beat up Gangrel. <laughs> the man with the best face in these games. <laughs> well, we gotta see his intro. I mean, come on. <sighs> oh, right. Yeah, they straight up uh, kept that intact. God, Gangrel. 
if I meet him one day. And then we will rebrand our group of vampires. Ha 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 ha. That's pretty much how he sounded. <laughs> At this point, I don't even consider them dark days. This <laughs> is right out of the gate. I guess I wasn't replay worthy. <laughs> I love the camera work on the uh, stalling uh, brain buster so much. All right, well, I am immediately in trouble. Gangrel looking like he'll be a bit more trouble here. Yeah, that's the thing. That's like the one drawback of the Royal Rumble mode is you don't really get to see how the camera will kind of uh, kind of spice some moves up. Come on! I got my uh, my fucking MMA kicks going on. <laughs> I just cannot get at it up fast enough. He is just ahead of me at every step in this match. I don't know what the difficulty is with this game. Like the match with Al Snow, like I had no problem at all, and Gangrel is just like he's awake. It's late. I mean, it is at night right now, and uh, I put a picture of myself in that AI descriptor thing, and uh, it said vampire. So I guess he knows my tricks because he's one as well. Yeah, that's where I like it. <laughs> people. I, I like that guy with the shirt that just says people. Trying to suck it though, that's that's not a great sign. <laughs> I think they might team up so that they uh, both form a shirt a shirt that says fart people. <laughs> the gang you'll never want to <laughs> want to meet. Oh. <laughs> There's also that one lady from uh, KOF 2002 that uh, that just has a shirt that says "fuck." So. Sometimes it's ambiguous whether uh, certain positions will rope break or not, but I guess we learned that one there. Oh. <laughs> yeah.
Ah, there we go. Count two! His feet were definitely in the ropes there. Again, every bit counts. Dang it. <laughs> Just gotta do it in the middle of the ring, I guess. <laughs> or maybe not. <laughs> We'll do one more and then um, we'll uh, move on from that. Man, Richard Richard is <laughs> not doing very well here. Okay, I'll correct that. We'll do one more if it's a 1v1. If it's a tag, we're just going straight to Royal Rumble. Tory for sustain a Hansen. <laughs> okay. That mm. <laughs> So for those that don't know much about Stan Hansen, uh basically he is the word Texas as a wrestler. And uh basically legally blind in one eye, and because of that, he would just lariat the fuck out of people in the ring. <laughs> Also, he was a big Japanese star, much more than a, uh, a Western star. I thought he was supposed to have a hat on. Maybe that was another outfit. Okay. I forget was uh I can't remember whether or not he was in WWF or WCW where he mostly just did promos where his basically his entire face was stuffed with chewing tobacco. <laughs> yeah. about to tackle us, but we knew better. Okay, yeah. WCW, the uh, federation that just completely ruined Mike Awesome. <laughs> Building up special pretty, pretty well. Okay, yeah, it was WCW then. WCW, like, it's a mixed bag, from what I can tell. Like, I feel like the good wrestlers were better than what w WWF had, but also it was just, it just came off as wildly inconsistent. Because, you know, WWF did not have Mortis.
uh, the Renegade, right? There was that whole thing, so... There was that, like, I don't know if it was public access or what, but it was one of those, you know, wrestling federations back in the day, like 1993 or 4 or something. Um, and it was just called the WWE. And what's funny is that they had a wrestler called Renegade, complete with the stick song as his entrance theme. Then WCW came up with the Renegade afterwards, so he changed his name to the original Renegade. <laughs> and that's not even a lie. Because he was. My thing is, there was a whole channel of all the WWE, like, matches and stuff. And, uh... Yeah, exactly. And it's just like... I think it was like Oklahoma Pro Wrestling? Where, where was... Hold on. There's only one way to figure this one out. No, that's not it. Where the hell? Uh, hmm. Oh, right, Berserker. Where, where's? The, I'm, I'm looking for the uh, looking for the wrestler. Okay, the Berserker. Okay. Minnesota? God, I can't remember now. It might have been Minnesota wrestling, but all that stuff is out there. They're all like VHS rips and all that. And that had a <laughs> that had the best manager of all time, Flamin' Raymond, <laughs> which they do that had a bright red mullet. <laughs> Then there was, uh, Michael The Rock Johnson, which, again, before Dwayne started calling himself The Rock. <laughs> now, this is a different Berserker, who assumedly never said that. Wait, was she trying to do, like, the, uh, the horns there, but her hand model just doesn't have the articulation for it? That's just gonna rope break again. I don't know why I keep doing that. Break. Oh. We're getting close. one way I'll be able to find that channel with all the WWE footage on it and I have to uh, have to search in my Twitter posts uh, addressed to one Honeydew Wilkins who had the uh, I think like the only video that was up of it like for a while yeah, it, it is the real WWE like it <laughs> legitimately And unlike, uh, you know, some other public access wrestling shows I've watched, IPW, thank you Jumpin' Jeff Farmer, uh, this one actually has some of the wrestlers doing, like, flying moves and stuff, <laughs> instead of just arm bars all the time. There are so many arm bars in IPW. Uh oh, this isn't gonna end well. He's adjusting his elbow pad. That again, specials last for like four seconds in this game. Hey, 
Hey, wait a minute. I thought this was it. Are DQ rolls even in this game? Oh god. Sorry, Stan Hansen. <laughs> there was a point where I was just kicking his model's head in that I just wanted to apologize to the real Stan Hansen for a bit there. I felt kind of bad. <laughs> Okay. Calypso. Why does Calypso keep drawing every single match? <laughs> I wish to have a wrestling match with you. You got the wrestling match you wanted. Too bad it'll last forever. <laughs> He's fucking minging. <laughs> oh god. We already had this match. All right, time for like the real meat and potatoes of any hockey game. I just noticed this is still uneasy. Nah, we'll keep it that way. <laughs> Too bad it's fucking minging. <laughs> Get him so no. <laughs> I'll pick Yaki man. This is like accurate for the time period, Matt Hardy. So he's just like a dude. Sure. Yes, 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 yes. Like time count. Uh is there a thing that'll explain what that is? Hold on. <laughs> Let me uh Oh yeah, yeah. All right. Countdown from ten. Oh wait. So like, if you disable it, it'll act just like Virtual Pro Wrestling too. Uh, yeah. Let's just let's go with that then. One day we'll figure out who actually designed Aki Man. That info is really hard to figure out. It's weird because we had that character Jekyll, who was just the nickname of one of the dudes from THQ. So I'm like, ah, oh, it's it's weird. <laughs> It really is like the Skullomania of which, of uh, Aki games. Except, uh, you know, there's a possibility of Skullomania showing up in other games, or, uh... I don't know about Aki, man, unfortunately. It's got the Misawa elbow, of course. Oh yeah, I saw that Hanzo mom was named Hannibal before, uh, 
Which uh, makes sense, because he was named that before. Back when he was just Hayabusa. But apparently the more people dig into the fake characters, the more they're not complete carbon copies. Like, Hanzaman is Hayabusa and Tiger Mask mixed together. Apparently. Naki Man is just like... He's one of those cases where people think he's Misawa. And he is, but also he's like eight other dudes mixed in, so he's basically his own character at this point. Naki Man apparently has his combo uh, stuff still in. Let's see. Alright. Oh, well, I guess we won't find out. Oh, maybe we will. Ow. Oh, I see. Okay. It's that guy. Okay, yeah, there it is. Didn't amount to much, though. <laughs> Come on. Alright, well, Matt, uh, you're gonna have to... Yeah, I was kind of wondering about that. Because I had a feeling something like was going to happen. But, dang. Which ass man am I? Oh, I added a Shadow Mr. Ass uh, costume. Yeah, I, I remember hearing that the code was still there, but not, like, the graphics or anything. Big... <laughs> the Big Butt Man, as uh, my cousin's friend apparently called him many a time. I forget if I ever told this story on stream, but apparently his uh, copy of No Mercy, uh, his friend played it. And he got so mad at Boss Man beating him that he went into the game... Changed his name to the Big Butt Man, gave him a blue afro, and then just shut the game off. <laughs> like, you know what, that's the... <laughs> oh. I really wish, like... I wonder if my copy from... Of no mercy is still kicking around at my old house, and just what weird ass creative characters are on it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Also, hey, haven't seen you in a while. Glad to see you. Oh. <laughs> this weird low drop kick. You can't hit the ass, man. Mm. Get out of here. Yeah, doing pretty all right. <laughs> oh, it's you again. You have glasses on this time, though. Like, the fact that the Attitude Era had a dude named Mr. Ass is one of their big names is just like... I can never tell if I love or hate that. I think it's a mixture of both. He's still going, too. Like... I'm not, uh... Dogging his ability at all. It's just, you know... Daddy Ass. <laughs>
I think it's just because it's so funny. Like... See, now this just looks like I'm playing normal WrestleMania 2000. Which I assure you, it's not. <laughs> that was... that was well-timed. Oh, yep. Wolfpack is back. <laughs> he was interested in me for a couple of seconds and then he was just like, yeah, let me... Just fight this guy instead. Now, what's funny is that we did look at a WrestleMania 2000 mod I found, but this is like where you can just boot the ROM up and everything's there instead of having to texture correct it and everything. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Misawa versus Ass Man. Yeah, I'll give Misawa a bit more time than that. I mean, come on. Oh. I just realized one of the people that was not uh, replaced in this hack was uh, Paul Bearer. <laughs> even though he's really not even re re really a wrestler, but... Yeah, it's Paul Bearer, why, why would you, you know... Oh. He still, as a wrestler, in this game, sucks, but you know... That is a good punch. Mr. Ass is a good button. Here. It's it's quick. It's got some range. Minimal recovery. Like, if we had somebody to analyze frame data in these games, we could just have somebody make the most powerful Aki wrestler in existence. <laughs> Great buttons, moves that do tons of damage, stuff like that. Guy always bugged me how her hair just is a different color when it gets to her shoulders. She was another character that, like, I think she had pretty low stats, so I changed that in my hack, but, uh... I think she's about the same in this. This is like... Man, she's better than that, though. <laughs> uh, version for a wrestling character? Yeah. I went into super mode by mooning Don Fry. That's just a sentence you're gonna have to like think about for a bit there. Uh oh. Uh oh, god, he's doing shoot fight stuff! <laughs> okay, I was getting cocky there. Yeah, that that would uh <laughs> that would be pretty in character for him, wouldn't it? <laughs> he just stared and was like, "I will remember that." I didn't 
really make much in the way of creative characters yet. Maybe next time I stream this, I will. <laughs> Something about Mr. Ass's perverse taunts that just goes straight into Don Fry. Just whoa. Okay, I recognize that glitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now, if that happened in the Attitude Era, then yeah. We got... That's not Hayabusa. That's H. Hayabusi. I've not actually seen him in his H gimmick. Let me, uh... Let me see... I'm just kind of curious. Hayabusa Unmasked gimmick? This would be around 1999. Oh, it's actually fairly hard to find images of this. Okay, yeah, now I see it. Yep, that's him, alright. <laughs> His face texture makes him look so much more older, though. Does Misawa have special? <laughs> Is that okay? Three! Yeah. Nobody was chanting. They were surprised. <laughs> Calypso. I replaced Kane and Undertaker with different forms of Calypso because, you know, I hate Kane and Undertaker, so. <laughs> then people always say that Twisted Metal Black Kane just looks like Kane. I mean, Twisted Metal Black Calypso looks like Kane, so. <laughs> That's gotta be Calypso. We have, um, lasted a very long time as Mr. Ass. Is Mr. Ass God tier? <laughs> I actually meant to exit the ring because I want to play somebody else now. <laughs> okay, who do I got this time? <laughs> yep, he live from Cheap Show. It's uh, this is actually Road Dog. Uh, but you know, it'll do just fine. Uh, hold on, this is uh. Okay, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Road Dog is apparently God tier going by the AI, so I doubt he is really, but Oops, so. I don't know why I keep saying it like that. I think it's because I'm black. 
like in a black of the character. I'm sure that did like no damage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ugh. You and your big bald head. There's so many bald people in Twisted Metal Black, I noticed. H. Boy. Oh. Oh, hey there. <laughs> Thanks for the hack. We're uh. <laughs> We're in the middle of a row rumble. <laughs> and, uh, uh. How many bald people are in Twisted Metal Black? Is there a comic series like a binge read only? Uh, there's only one Twisted Metal Black, uh, no, Twisted Metal 2 comic. Um, and yeah, it was only like 12 pages or something. Eli Silverman cannot, uh, not pin him for very long. Calypso still hanging in there. China has, uh... That is Eli Silverman from the, uh... The show, Cheap Show. Um... Under the hood, though, it's just Road Dog. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, it just kind of teleported there. How's this thing been so far? Uh, pretty fun. Uh, <laughs> the AI in uh, WrestleMania 2000, as we discussed, is mega weird, but it's been a great time so far. Who, who knows you? <laughs> I love that No Mercy, uh, this face texture uh yeah i set it to easy and even on easy it's like they'll be manageable and then just become like a god halfway through <laughs> i already forgot what match we had that going on in in uh road to wrestlemania it was um Funny thing is, The Rock is actually Aki Man, if you look closely. Um, they just grabbed his uh, his uh, face from WrestleMania 2000 and put it in No Mercy, because I guess they thought it looked funny. Uh, we got Oz. I would have made that an outfit, but I just ran out of time. <laughs> It's really cool. Again, just yeah, just the fact that you rarely see anybody do anything with WrestleMania 2000 is uh, really interesting. <laughs> well. Whose theme is this? It's Kiritawe. Again, would have made an I Maya Inca boy. Ran out of time. <laughs> the stream started fairly late because I just like fell asleep for a bit. Oh, right. 
Oh, they're doing the test of strength. I don't think I've seen a test of strength in this game all night. Ugh. Sorry, China, but you know. Uh, here the default. Is it gonna be? Yep. <laughs> They have the... Oh, oh. <laughs> really? <laughs> I never knew that. <laughs> That's... Oh yeah, because bear hug is like the first move in the uh... cause I, I looked at the um... there's that cheat to kind of bring out the dummy and the hoe character as like actual character slots and the dummy just basically assigns whatever move comes first in the list and I think he got a bear hug finisher Dake Ken. It got very, very new Japan in the ring when I wasn't looking. Or all Japan, I should say. No, not Onita! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> hey, you already got knocked out. You can't come back. What a mixture of people to have in the ring together. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you know. <laughs> oh, was he? Huh. Oh, right. I still need to mess with that. Oh. <laughs> that would be a good, like, wrestling obscurity. Li like. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> like, I gotta, um... One idea I had for Virtual Pro Wrestling 2, should I ever want to actually make, like, you know, actually sit down with the coding necessary to make, like, a ROM hack, um, was Virtual Pro Wrestling 2, but, uh, the entire roster is just weird occurrences in, uh, wrestling games, and, uh, Ric Flair, Jeff Jarrett would definitely be in that list. <laughs> It's like them, some of the acclaim jobbers, uh, like that one time Afro Thunder was in a TNA game. <laughs> yeah, the acclaim jobbers I've been obsessed with ever since I was like 12, they're just so fascinating. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, um... I never cross-referenced the move list or anything. I mean, I haven't really messed with, uh, Wrestling Revolution in a while. Um... I don't think any of the jobbers in Anarchy Rules are based off of anybody in particular, either. Ha <laughs> 
I think PS1 was like the closest I ever got to um to ROM hacking because back in the day I texture hacked the hell out of Tekken 2 and 3. Uh, but those files are lost to time. <laughs> I did notice, like, Twisted Metal 2's textures are just right there in the open, so I could probably just do wild stuff with that game, but... It also helps that in Twisted Metal 1, all of the endings are in text format, <laughs> so... I like that in, uh, Project Outsider, it's like... Just the der 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 looped over and over again because it was originally Viscerous theme. <laughs> I think maybe saying. Oh, Jesus. I think setting the difficulty to easy may have uh, been a mistake in the rumble. Roshi Hase. Who, like, I'm not used to seeing now, because most of my experience with Virtual Wrestling 2 is, uh, Freeman Edition. I'm like, oh yeah, he was, he was in that game. I was fascinated, like... God, yeah, Talway was in there for quite a while. <laughs> Wait, who's this? Oh. <laughs> yeah. We had, a. Uh... We had Don Fry in here earlier, the, uh, as I call him, the famed Always Sunny cameo man. Because, uh, in the episode where Roddy Piper first showed up on that show, uh, Don Fry is the dude he's beating up. And I did not know that until much later. <laughs> Yeah, I was really interested in reading, like, you know, who didn't make it in because of just, you know, the move requirements. Not in, like, a demeaning way. I actually find it very interesting how, uh, <laughs> it's like, who will actually, like, work here, you know? Because <laughs> sometimes it's just like that. Whoa, <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> At the same time, though, that just makes the hack more unique. That doesn't really, uh, doesn't have all of them. Granted, I am a hacker who's, uh... <laughs> yeah, right. So, I, I wanted to replace Triple H, and I didn't have... I didn't have much of an idea who to replace him at that point. So I just grabbed one of the home models, and was just like, this kind of looks like a Hot Topic cashier to me, and, uh... Yeah. <laughs> That's, also, I'm just glad that uh, this is an engine where I'm able to have, like, long names, so I wanted to take advantage of that. Um, also, the Triple H fact that I know that there's actually a reference to it in my hack. Um, in the Japanese dub of Blade 3, uh, I forget... I don't know if it was, like, the VHS dub or what, but, uh... Triple H is dubbed by Masahiro Chono. And it's like, I have to track that down. <laughs> it's so weird, like... <laughs> I 
Oh, is it? I haven't really messed with uh, too much of the creative character items yet. Oh, is this our? Wow, this uh, this is our last four here. <laughs> Yeah, I'll, <laughs> I'll do something with that. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> I'm sorry, so... <laughs> so It's, uh, it's how it goes with random select. But also I started as Aki Man, so... I did, like, a watch mode rumble of uh, Virtual Pro Wrestling uh, 2 Freeman down. I don't know why I said it in full there. Um... I filled all of the creator character slots and did like that code where it's like, hey, call in some of the uh, creator characters. Um, oh no. Well, I guess we'll see who the real winner is now. <laughs> um, and yeah, during that entire time, only one of them appeared. <laughs> and didn't even do that good. And I was like, man, <laughs> all that work. <laughs> Then again, there was always Parsec net play, so, you know. Oh, let me... Okay. Just checking. This is on easy, so God knows how long this is going to go on. <laughs> I'm glad it repeated the real replay of the round there. Me getting punched in the head, I guess. <laughs> Hot topic wins. <laughs> Jesus. I'm always fascinated by, like, the home models, because I always wonder if they were, like... They, um... If, if they were based on real people or not. Oh, did they? Or are they? <laughs> I always wondered. Oh, whoops. Ah, of course. <laughs> then we'll do uh, a couple more... Interesting, they have Aki versions of themselves. That's really strange to think about. I'll say, hey, thanks for, uh... <laughs> he got... <laughs> some business guy, uh... Close. Yeah, uh, Val Venus, because I am not the biggest fan of Val Venus, to say the least. Uh, wait, we're fighting Stan Hansen again? Okay, um, but... Yeah, he's replaced by Rick Mayle's character from, uh, the show Bottom, because <laughs> it just felt appropriate. Uh... <laughs> Calypso and Calypso. I guess we're, uh, fighting Hanson again. He's got, uh... He's got a grudge against us, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he's, um, I'm not gonna say too much, uh, but he is, uh, he's an example of how being a stoner does not automatically mean that you are a chill dude, because, uh, boy, he subverts that. Uh, but anyway. <laughs> also regarding Bigger Tori, uh, yeah, I, I love the change so much, it's so cool. 
Um, but bigger Tori here, which in hindsight I should have just renamed her Terry Powers. Um, this is an edited version of her uh, that my girlfriend was basically requested for tonight. And we call her Bigger Tori because uh, she's like six foot in real life and uh, doesn't seem like any of the games acknowledge that. And also, I made her strikes way better and gave her some actual grapple moves. <laughs> and buffed up her stats and uh... Almost a completely different character at this point. <laughs> I'm not sure what, uh... What the black and green was. I did that, like, or earlier today. It may have been a DX reference, I'm not sure. <laughs> We're not doing good. He's real pissed about last time. Oh. oh, okay. That might actually be a... Uh... That may mean it may be the uh, easiest version of flying, then. Because I have, um, like a friend, like a friend of a friend, uh, is the reason why I have a couple, uh, dubs of both the Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat movies. And, uh, I think both of those also have two different dubs. Ugh. And the Street Fighter movie is so weird to hear in Japanese, because they just kind of have to go with the fact that the names have changed. <laughs> uh. I also completely forgot his name was Jarko Grimwood. <laughs> it's like... Uh. He's hurting real bad. Although I think it might just be the injury indicators uh, happen a lot faster in this game. <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> there should be a vampire called Michael McGillicuddy. In something, I don't know what, but... <laughs> the Akira Mita kicks. <laughs> Alright. Stan Hansen grudge match went the same way, so. <laughs> I keep forgetting Blade is, uh. <laughs> I keep forgetting Blade is even a comic. <laughs> Jargo, baby! I just have to appreciate that whoever booked this. <laughs> Who are our champions, by the way? <laughs> it's, uh... I never got much into comics. I got into very specific manga, like, very late in my life, basically. Oh boy. Okay, what do we got here? Bebome. 
Hey, chance to play as Toyota again. <laughs> yeah, Toyota is like a character I saw and I'm like, I have to pick her. Like, the Virtual Pro Wrestling 1 model just made me so happy. <laughs> um, US Con I, I feel like just movies have made me kind of tired of like US superhero stuff. Um, I would say, uh, I mean, JoJo just finished up its last part, so I'm not really reading that, because it's not really going at the moment, <laughs> but. Then there was, like, a... Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm totally down with that, like... I had to realize, I, I grew up on Mortal Kombat Trilogy, so I love this kind of stuff. <laughs> MK1 Kano is so funny. Like, it's just like, they just edited a bunch of his animations for no reason, and I can't tell why. They just grafted MK3 Kano's torso on him when he wins. It's like, alright. <laughs> And then it's like, you have MK2 Kung Lao, and it's like, oh, he's like the second best character in the game. <laughs> he just does way too much damage for no reason. MK Trilogy is still probably my favorite MK, I just... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love that kind of stuff. <laughs> well, in that case, um, <laughs> there's always a. Uh... Oh, hey there. <laughs> Hello, wife. We were doing uh, we're we're wrestling. Uh, not very well, but. Oh god. Hey, okay. <laughs> Wife City all of a sudden. Uh, but. <laughs> I can't even see what emote that was. Is that a, is that a dog? <laughs> um. That's one benefit of all the weird as shit, like. Mortal Kombat Mugen projects, because you literally have no idea who you're going to be fighting at any point. <laughs> what? what uh? Jarrett doing one of the longest taunts in Aki history, I believe. Though Nash's is probably longer. Jesus. Ah. <laughs> the MK projects on Mugen are like... There's one side of it that are actually very good, since they rebooted the engine to be like, playable and feel good. Then of course you get the side where it's just like, add everyone. <laughs> just. I had a really weird moment where one character I made in Mugen just ended up in one of those projects, and I'm like, wait... <laughs> Some of those moments on the internet were just kind of like, man, I don't know what is happening anymore. <laughs> There was also, uh... 
Yeah, even even though it was just a sprite swap of an existing character, I'm like, I'm, I'm glad they acknowledged it. <laughs> uh, but... I don't know what I expected to happen there. Uh... Yeah, there's also, uh, in development right now, uh, guys making a Mortal Kombat game in, uh... Oh, made entirely in, uh, Fusion, and, uh, it looked incredible already. <laughs> it's basically one of those, like, trilogies where everyone is in it, and, uh, he's going full hog with the mechanics. <laughs> What the hell I was doing there? Not doing Toyota much justice here. <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna complain if you want to tag in the guy with less spirit. That's fine. <laughs> Come on. Okay, I got it. I gotta tag in Tori. <laughs> she has to be on the side first. <laughs> yeah, why not? Let's just do that. Oh. That's why not. Please get up. Please get up. Okay. The standard Aki crouching taunt of uh, just bopping yourself on the head. Oh my god, dude. Tori, get back here. <laughs> yeah. Head bop. I am not. I hope I am not speaking, uh, foul profanity by saying that. <laughs> I'll, have to, I'll have to look that up then. Wow, I can't believe how bad I'm doing his Toyota here. Usually I do much better. <laughs> yeah, thanks, because I will probably completely forget to due to my, uh, Goldfish memory here. I was talking about it earlier, it's like... As, like, somebody that's interested in, like, fighting game, like, frame data, and what, like, you know, basic attacks are best and whatnot... I'm really curious how, like, if you look at the Aki games, it's like, who has the best buttons? You know? <laughs> the answer, probably the MMA guys. But... <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> oh yeah, back elbow. Uh, the parry Saturn sweep does not actually seem to be in this game, which uh, was like... Uh, Aki's most feared basic of all time, I think. <laughs> Or unless it is in here, and I just... Oh, does Steiner have it? Oh, the tackle, right, right. Tackle's not bad. The startup's a little eh, but... Ugh! Oh, yeah, that... yeah, that... that is nasty. <laughs> Yeah, see, they're just... They're going... Going super mode here. <laughs> oh god! He countered that, like, light speed.
I imagine. Uh, like, I'm learning a lot about what's not in this game compared to the others. Oh. <laughs> he tried to counter that, didn't he? <laughs> oh, God. Okay, let's try Toyota again. No, that's not... <laughs> Please. Thank you. Get in. Come on. Or, or not. <laughs> I don't know. What's... I can't hit buttons good right now. Oh, God. What is going on with these two? Basically what I was talking about earlier, on normal mode, against Road Dogg and X-Pac, this was just how the match went. Like, just non-stop counters, going into special every two seconds. Yeah. Also, a friend said apron flying attacks are pretty good as well. That was right next to the ropes, but <laughs> we'll take that. Ah! Uh, what happened there? Uh... <laughs> right, right, right. I don't know too much about Boss Man. Uh, I learned a lot of weird stuff about Jeff Jarrett, though. <laughs> that he was in the, uh... Whatever that, like, weird Christian uh, wrestling show was called, where Ron Reese was, uh... Oh god. I had the idea just now of making him the gold team. Have a broom! How do you throw shit? I forgot how you throw stuff. <laughs> I lost it. Oh, okay. And yeah, right, Vince Russo somehow was responsible for that one. I say I say somehow because like it was actually pretty inoffensive. That was just like, eh, you know, it's harmless. That's you rarely get to say anything about that regarding something Russo made. I also had Ron Reese in a silly mask uh, doing the dusty elbow elbows at people, and uh, that was pretty funny. <laughs> okay. Mm. Ah. 
hit just a second too late. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> I did manage to get the uh, silver dummy in uh, WrestleMania 2000 uh, at some point, but... <laughs> Yeah, it makes sense, because I was like, wait, who is Aki Man replacing? And I was like, oh yeah, it was the dummy. Right. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> I thought you just said, like, WrestleMania 2000 in general for a second there. But yeah, no, like... <laughs> Come on, don't wake up. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the uh, default value character, basically. And, uh... The default move would be the chop. <laughs> Oh, is it not? I was... Oh, his moves are your moves. Weird. Oh, wait, okay, now I know what was going on. When I when I showcased him, uh, it was a mirror match. So, like, he just didn't have moves. <laughs> he just kind of slid into the uh, ring, from what I remember. Me and Sasha had, like, a... Uh, playlist of, like, just weird stuff in wrestling games. Uh, so I might have to just put together into a video and upload it to YouTube or something, because, uh, it being in a Twitter moment thread. Just, uh, yeah. yeah! He did not go down for a second. God damn. Good old silver Aki man. I could technically, technically just make him a character of his own. No, no, no. <laughs> no, nothing can really interrupt my stream. My commentary is like the most stream of a uh, stream of consciousness commentary you'll ever hear. Oh, Melly at this point. Melvana is kind of a. Uh, tied to pre-transition stuff, so, you know. Not that I, like, totally mind it, but, you know. <laughs> I don't know what I was trying to do there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> And he just got back up from it. That just slap slaps nuts. Tori, help! <laughs> Tori's actually got higher spirit than I do, so uh. Jeff Jarrett needs some Mida kicks to the head. <laughs> yeah. 
There's so much suck it as well, which I mean that that was just the time. I feel like next time, like, you know, when I actually do that proper, uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh... <laughs> yeah, that... <laughs> Something Frank Reynolds would say about the 60s, I'm pretty sure. But, uh... <laughs> oh, whoa! But, uh... If I ever do, like, a proper ROM hack, I want to change the signs to be, like, stuff you would see in, like, Attitude Era signs or something like that. As, as much as I- oh! <laughs> as, as much as I begrudgingly admit it, uh, that one- that one No Mercy mod where, uh, there's, like, a South Park sign in the crowd, um, that's pretty accurate. <laughs> God, if only. Oh, I thought I thought his AI was gonna be too stupid to break that up. The uh, Lupin styled uh, the Rock is definitely gonna have to be in there, though. Come on. Thank you. <laughs> oh, come on, that was perfect timing for that. This is gonna go on for another hour, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I probably could have gained a lot of spirit by actually finishing that, but you know. Mr. Ass approves. I was noticing Mr. Ass actually has really good basics. <laughs> like that, that, like step boxing jab is one of the better uh, strikes I've seen. It's like it's got good range, minimal startup, it's really fast. <laughs> It's funny because, like, you know, tierless with these games. Like, with wrestling games, it's a little harder to do because there's so many characters, but... Uh, I've heard the consensus with No Mercy, I think, like, S plus tiers like X-Pac and Perry Saturn. I don't know how accurate that is, but... Ugh. I just want to remind everybody this is on easy mode. <laughs> Like, damn, you know, I rented... Yeah, like, the sweep kick, I think, is, like, the speedrunning tool, more or less, from what I heard. I think Xbox Secret is that, like, you can just kind of keep doing his finisher over and over again. I did hear when it comes to revenge, uh, Aki Man is pretty up there, which, uh, makes sense. He's kind of got everything. Tori, help. Tori, help. There you go. 
I also want to point out, Tori had, like, uses up all the, uh, the stat points from the offensive and defensive. <laughs> Oh, nice. Come on. I don't know why it reminds me that uh, in No Mercy you can just you can just hack people to have uh, Vader's um, like corner punches or something that are just kind of there. Holy shit! Okay. <laughs> <sighs> Finally. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I. Again, easy mode. That was easy mode. <laughs> Now, they're always trying to push Calypso, but... If this is a singles match, I'll do another one. If, uh, if it's a tag match, I think I'm gonna call it for tonight. <laughs> one of them is Austin Powers, though. <laughs> I literally just like grabbed an Austin Powers off of Game Facts. <laughs> it's just so, like. <sighs> Do we go for it? Actually, yeah, let's just. <laughs> the uh, face they use for Austin Powers in WrestleMania 2000 um, is not here, but thankfully there is a perfect face for him anyway. <laughs> Aki is full of good faces. <laughs> Man, I... <laughs> I wish there was an easy way to just make Titan Trons like this for anybody. <laughs> Oh, I didn't change the music for him. <laughs> Does that think I did? <laughs> now nah, this isn't Hayabusa. Uh, H is still uh, what? He, this is Bradshaw. <laughs> I entered special mode, baby! <laughs> Higher Bruce of Awesome Powers would be the funniest shit of all time. <laughs> Don't push me, baby! Ow! <laughs> And yeah, with uh, this edit of Tori here, I'm just like... I just gave her what I think is one of the, uh, some of the best strikes in the game. <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, because Hanzelmon is just kind of Tiger Mask and Hayabusa mixed together, from what I remember, but, uh... I also just appreciate that, like, 
they're different forms of the characters from Virtual Pro Wrestling too. Like seeing H instead of Hayabusa is uh Yeah, Jericho into the mask, yeah. Was it like Jekyll had Reese's face and Maya Inca Boy had uh Stevie Ray's face? Very very weird. Somebody came up with that. I just. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the name Hanzo Mod doesn't actually mean anything. This is even funnier because the Japanese uh, programming team worked on the game, so they were just like, okay. I imagine they were just like, alright, we're doing this, I guess. <laughs> oh, is this? Huh, I get. I guess I never really realized that until now. Austin Powers is getting his mojo. Whoa! <laughs> Farouk with the psychic powers. Maybe. It does kind of fit the bill of like what WCW would come up with as a ninja though. They would just get the name like half right and then fuck it up somehow. Yeah, Sasha actually uh, hipped me to that like a week, like a couple weeks ago, is that Hanzaman and Kim Chi did show up in other games. They didn't really look the same, though. The kimchi had hair and everything. I'll have to ask her about it later, because I definitely want to like add a reference to that if I do the obscurity hack or whatever. Um, like Dim Sum or whatever the hell they called him in uh, WCW, like World Tour. Uh, but he looked a lot like Ramen Man to me. <laughs> Kimchi and Dim Sum, Christ. Um. There was a character that Way of the Warrior had that was like a super hidden character, and uh... And uh... I, you know, I went to an Indian restaurant, and I found it really funny that that is uh... You know, that uh, the actual food, Gulab Jamun, is actually there. Because I knew it was a food, but I never just had the opportunity to uh... <laughs> I really should have just called her Terry Power and, like, made her wrestle like Terry Power. As I couldn't remember if, uh, her name was Terry Power Powers. Especially since, you know, Austin is in the ring. Oh my god, okay. Yeah, Austin's got his fucking mojo, that's for sure. <laughs> nah, he woke up too early. Oh! 
Oh, whoops! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> then, then she just made fun of Aston Powers. Ugh. Drop kick's a little slow to be spamming that much. At the time, I'm meaning to do another move. Neutral B is the axe kick. Whoa! <laughs> I love when you get grabbed in the middle of an animation like that, and it's just... Oh, Beef Wellington! Yeah, just make that, like... They should have made Dr. Death into Beef Wellington. I do appreciate Professor Kill, though, from, uh... Virtual Pro Wrestling. That's such a good name. Come on. There was Muhammad Ali in the first game, it was like... Muhammad Darley or something like that. Yeah. Oh my god. Momado Dolly. God, that is. <laughs> it's like when JoJo's came up with a character that's supposed to be called Muhammad Abdul, but they called him Muhammad Abdul. <laughs> Which I... Except in that case, that was just romanization going wrong. Uh... Pretty Tomoko? Huh. I remember Eagle Sawada in uh, Queen Special was like Falcon Sawada or something like that. Wait, did I say Eagle Sawada by accident? Eagle Sawai, I meant. Yeah. <laughs> the name Sawada, thanks to Street Fighter, has just taken on so many <laughs> more meanings to me. Yeah, it's just interesting to see, like, a fake copyright-free version of a... Oh yeah, they might be a fusion. Oh. Maybe it's something to look into. Maybe she's just, like, a... A Joshi Aki man, which, uh. Man, if I make. Uh, I should probably update Aki Woman to be that, actually. <laughs> I made her in my, uh, my hack, but it was based off of a deathmatch wrestler. Oh, yeah! That was definitely gonna be in my, uh, obscurity hack, like, Vader Aja Kong. Is it Aja Kong and Bam Bam Bigelow? I, I love the era of wrestling games that are just like... <laughs> I think the way that uh, they were trying to do it is it almost seemed like Vader in an Aja Kong costume rather than straight up Aja Kong. At least that's how it came off. <laughs> Vader as big bam bam big. <laughs> he can do it all, you know. <laughs> Oh, a tea stable would be so cool. Beware of chamomile. <laughs> Damn it! 
I may have gotten too cocky there, but it's fine. Yeah. Seeing Tori choke slam Austin Powers is probably one of the best things I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, I know you don't. Come on, this was in Tori's move set already. I didn't add this. It's always interesting when the when Aki games give the women actual like moves because it doesn't happen very much. Like I always joke about the cat from No Mercy because they just made her into like Boz Rutan basically, <laughs> like a Misawa Boz Rutan uh, mishmash. Oh, is he? Oh, that makes sense, okay. <laughs> Interesting. Far from the first time I've heard, uh, heard Japanese characters named after locations, so... That's, that's cool. <laughs> oh yeah, so I guess it would be said, like, Hanzo Uman. Come on. Manami, help. Oh my god. Yeah, that's kind of the thing with romanization. Like, there is a character in a Silver Case game, uh, named Osato, but I think it's technically romanized as Osato, and it just really throws me off. Okay. I forgot to put some Silver Case characters in this. Anyway. <laughs> Yeah, that would uh, that would check out, I imagine. Oh, Fizzler Star romanization is a mess. Souther has like twelve different names. It's Souther, but then sometimes it's Salza, but then it's Souther, but then it's Thouser, but then it's Thouza. Souza. <laughs> It also reminds me of Rima Riru from uh, Samurai Showdown. I've seen her name romanized as Riminarel or something. <laughs> oh yeah. I forgot that Streets of Rage has both Souther and Harsh in it. Which is like, yeah. <laughs> Oi! <laughs> I was just sliding there. That was interesting. God damn!
<laughs> All right, <laughs> we take those. The fan game is weird because they added that one ninja lady, and I wasn't like too familiar with Streets of Rage at the time. So I was just totally convinced that was a character that was in the series. Okay, let's, uh... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> allergies, allergies have been going crazy in October. I don't know what's going on. figure, like, the idea of Austin Powers being in a figure four leg lock, I can already see, Mike, like, a close-up of Mike Myers doing a silly face. Damn it! Oh my god, what is happening over there? So not Randy, baby. No. <laughs> mash, 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 mash. Okay. I can't even tag in my other opponent because she's having her own match in the background. <laughs> or my my partner. I mean, my opponent can't even tag in. As I don't want to do a British accent. I feel like I'm just gonna fuck it up. Cause the thing is, when I do it, it's uh, yeah, Rudra. That was her name. She fits in so well. I just didn't know she was just an OC that was thrown in there. I just like that Streets of Rage remake also just made portraits of everybody, but most of them are traced over, uh... Traced over... Oh god! Traced over, like, KOF 2000 portraits. <laughs> so I think the Whip Lady was, uh, traced over, uh, Shadow from Eternal Champions. Uh, Shiva was Iori. Oh, oh god! <laughs> uh, Rudra, I think, traced over Leona. <laughs> Ellie, yeah. <laughs> also, like, Ellie Super just traced over a, an animation from, uh, Whip, so... There's a lot of KOF hidden in Streets of Rage Remake. Oi! Yeah, a little weird. <laughs> but hey. I remember Ashes didn't really seem to be traced over anything. Come on, Austin. <laughs> Stone Cold Austin Powers. 
Oh, I see. That would explain a lot. <laughs> That's a fun when you're on the receiving end, is it? Right, your feet were in the ropes. Hey there. <laughs> uh, I don't imagine he does. I don't know if Bradshaw ever had chops. I don't know much about Bradshaw, but... Jesus Christ. <laughs> hey, she did the, um... She did the actual Virtual Pro Wrestling 1 uh, win pose there. <laughs> oh yeah, the chaps, well, you know. <laughs> Calypso and Calypso. Both won. I th Whoa! Hold on. We got a story uh, development going on here, I think. <laughs> Onita? <laughs> I'm not sure. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, what happened? <laughs> uh, did something go wrong here? Yeah, I, I don't know. Um, wait, what's going on? I hit start. <laughs> I'm not sure what's happening. Oh, okay, there we go. Yeah, this is a call. Wait, why is my tiny part of Mark Henry now? <laughs> wait. Uh, I think it should still be Ivory. Yeah, it's just for that. But I guess, uh, it just took something from none, maybe? Yeah, very, uh... You know, I'm totally down for that, <laughs> so... <laughs> I am gonna miss having Manami Toyota as a partner, but, you know... Uh, original B. <laughs> you know, I did not know that this was Johnny Ace's face the entire time. <laughs> oh, I did, yeah. Yeah. Oh, is it? <laughs> That's weird. Wait, what? Huh. That's very strange. I didn't know there was, like, actually, like, a similar story branching story mode thing, so you get angry for twenty four ounces, but I'm gonna uh Yeah, I don't know. 
a succubus. I uh, will will not elaborate further. Uh, <laughs> So, you know, I'm 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 down with the idea that we have no idea where Tori, bigger Tori, will land. So, <laughs> uh, I think that's gonna be it for me tonight, though. It's like one in the morning. I gotta work tomorrow, and <laughs> again. <laughs> Oh, okay, so that's just a blessing in disguise, then. <laughs> I see. Yeah, thanks for uh, making this. I'm uh, glad to mess with a different game. <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah, it's late at night, and I gotta work tomorrow, so... Uh... Hey, thanks, everybody, who stopped by. Uh, definitely do check out this raw Mac. Uh... Yeah, thanks. And I'll see y'all later. <laughs>